Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to Hers and His Adventures in California. Uh, again, I'm on a solo trip, and I'm out here in the Delta in Stockton, and uh, I should be trying for salmon, but there's no salmon. You can't get salmon from this area, um, so I'm probably going to cast out for bass, maybe striper, catfish, and uh, sunfish. So if you're enjoying these videos, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification button for upcoming videos. Okay, on this first one we're going to throw out a uh, frozen bluegill. Actually, you might need to let this defrost a little bit before we throw it out. But we're going to throw out a bluegill, whole bluegill. Um, hoping for some catfish on this. Then we'll throw red worms out on the uh, sunfish pole. Let's see if we can get the hook in this one even though it's frozen. Okay, there you go. Pretty big bait, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Big frozen bluegill. Okay, now we're going to throw out some jumbo red worms on the sunfish pole. There we go. We usually fish morning, afternoon, and one time we came here, uh, it was probably about an hour and a half before sunset, and I decided to throw like a, I'm not sure what kind of lure it's called, I call them spinners. Um, got a little body on it, and then a, a little mess of like wire, and then a yeah. spinner on it. Yeah. And uh, be damned if a crappie didn't pick it up, bro. Right here on this bridge, yeah. Oh, there we go. So what are you trying for now? I'm just throwing out there whatever hits it now. <laughs> I can't imagine how many YouTube channels there are that are titled something similar to whatever bites. Hit a salmon. Oh, a big ass bass at first until we seen its head. Yeah. And now it's not. At that point, because a friend of mine caught a 31 inch salmon when I was fishing at Wastegate. He's walking back. Matter of fact, I, it wasn't enough to make a video for that individual. I, I failed the whole day. He caught one fish. He was off fishing by himself, came back, says, Oh, look. So, on my next video, I can produce him. I'll put his salmon in there. Mind if I get it on video? Okay, everybody. This is an acquaintance of mine, Dorian Hang. And he's been fishing alongside me all this time. I didn't even realize it. Okay. Holy crap. Oh, my God. And look at the striper he pulled out. That was a salmon. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. That's a big salmon, Dorian. Yeah, that's my largest fish for salmon. That's all, right. why, that's all you were fishing yeah. for today? I was salmon? fishing this property, too. But I so throw in some um, the flying sea. Because the, the salmon been breaching the water since last Thursday. So, might as well give it a shot then. And from, third cast? from right here in Westgate. Right oh my so the god. the guys out there caught one too, but they lost it at the bank. Like seriously. Ten minutes before me. So you think they come into the alcove here? Yeah, they're coming out here. They do? It, it, until the dock you see them breaching. Wow. Man, that's woo, that's some good eating right there. Here, I'll give you guys a scale. That's my hand. <laughs> I don't know, that's gotta be uh I got 32 it. inches or something. I think it's gonna be I think okay. it's about 40. 40? Okay. I'm good with that. <laughs> How long are you going to be out here? 
size there. No, that's not too bad at all. There we go, people. Decent sized bluegill. Probably about seven inches. Really little. Small one. Oh, shoot, he fell off. I'll be damned. Bites on the bluegill pole on the bluegill yet? <laughs> Talking to my video. I'll cast it back out, see if we can get something to bite it. Whoa. Is it a bass? Yeah. Oh, wow. I was like, okay, they got a big sunfish. Oh, wow. I was like, okay, they got a big sunfish. Hey, Michael. Want to wave? You're on video now. <laughs> That's Michael, everybody, a buddy of mine. He's out here trying to go for some crappie right now. Said uh, the other day, red ears were biting a lot, and uh, he did well on crappie the other night. Bad hook job, you guys see that?
Okay, well, what was the names again? JB, bro. JB and? Yeah, Adam. Adam? Okay, I'm Ken, man. Yeah, a, little, a little decent one. There you go, a little something something. <laughs> there you go, <laughs> JB. Oh, that was a big bike, bro. Oh, man. Something big is down there. Oh, man, that's heartbreaking. I missed that. Are you kidding me? You got a little bass? Yeah. Holy crap, that's a tiny one. I think the smallest bass I ever caught was about two inches, maybe inch and a half. Lodi Lake. I haven't caught a goddamn thing in Lodi Lake. <laughs> <laughs> I have one video up there when I went bluegill and sun fishing, and man, it was so active you wouldn't believe the activity, but you couldn't get nothing of size. It was all tiny ones. I must have cost like, caught like 80 of them. super nice but yeah it definitely bent the pole you guys want this one i'll take it if you don't want it so yeah yeah no nah, that's cool it's all you well where you at boss okay oh for sure man Yes, <laughs> I should have used that as a strategy. You're not getting bites, you're not getting bites. You set the pole down, right. then the, and you go get busy, then the bites come. That's exactly what freaking happened. Hi. I'm just here fishing, so I thought I'd call and say hi. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm still here fishing. How was it? Actually, two guys next to me are Filipino, ironically. Um, uh, and and Michael was here. I don't know if you remember Michael, the Mexican. Oh, one of them just caught one. One of them just hooked up. I'm about to see what he's pulling up. Um, it's actually when I got here, it was really active. Um, it slowed down a bit, but there's still some activity. Sadly, I didn't hook a huge amount. Yeah, he says a small one right now. See that orange? Yeah. That's intense. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not too shabby right there. But okay, everybody. Uh, it's not really been a slow day, but it's been hard pulling up something. So there you go. Nice bluegill, probably a male. Okay, I'm gonna throw out this spinner bait now. Hopefully, we can get something on this. Nothing was picking up the live bluegill. And sun fishing died down. So we get a bass or striper to bite at this.
Oh man, is it bigger? Shit. No. Damn it. You got you hooked up? Yeah, I had something big on there and then it got hooked up. Now I don't think I'm gonna be able to get the fish. Fuck. Wouldn't be the first time I've climbed on this bridge or under it. Matter of fact, one of my videos, is I'm underneath the bridge. And you get a good view of the underside, and I lost it. I'm gonna be burning with curiosity. What the fuck was that, you know? God damn, it took my line, my hook.